Bee Collective is a collaboration of designers and beekeepers who work together to find new ways of beekeeping in the urban uh, environment. Uh, with the SCIF, we try to make beekeeping more accessible in the city. There are a lot of beekeepers who are starting to keep bees on rooftops, but um, we were wondering how we can make the bees more visible so that people know that the bees are there and they become more accepted in the city environment. That's how we came up with the idea to put bees on a pole. The sky is about seven meters high and this is a distance that feels safe for people, uh, while the bees are still very visible. Uh, it works like this, you push a button, the hives come down and the beekeepers can take care of the bees. Uh, when they finish, they close the hives, push a button again uh, and the hives go back up and all the bees go back into the hives. The Skype works on electricity, which is generated from the solar panels on top of the hives. Uh, so it doesn't need any uh, electrical connection, which makes it possible to put the sky virtually anywhere. We are not aiming to put uh, enormous amounts of bees in one city. We just want to spread some skies around Europe. That would be in very visible places in the bigger cities, so that a lot of people see them and start thinking about the importance of bees. We harvest some of the honey and sell it here in Maastricht. Uh, we use this money to finance the beekeeping because every year we have to make small investments. Uh, or when a colony disappears, we can get a new one. Uh, we want to make sure people know bees are having trouble surviving while they are very uh, important for our food production. So the sky is like, uh, like an advertising for bees. One other aspect that we find important is that the knowledge of older beekeepers doesn't disappear. So we invite an uh, experienced beekeeper to guide the group of new beekeepers and show them how it works. Uh, this way we make sure the knowledge is passed on to the next generation so that they can take care of bees in the future. The city is, in our opinion, the best place to do this because there are most people to see it. Uh, and also if you compare it to the monoculture on the countryside, uh, there is a much wider variety of food for bees and hardly any pesticides. We don't think everybody should become a beekeeper and everybody should have bees in his yard, but uh, if we can raise some awareness, that uh, would be great.